Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Oliver here from Love M44 and I'm delighted to be uh, with Danny today at uh, Brody's Kitchen. So thank you for joining me. Now some of you uh, driving up obviously Liverpool Road have probably seen this brand new eatery uh, appear and looking dead modern as you can see. Um, so first of all, where, where did the name come from? Um, well, it originally it's uh, a sort of a bit of a mixture really with my surname, which is Broadest um, yeah. and the American theme. So I didn't want to use my surname, it's not really a, a saleable name as such, but... Broadest um, kitchen, bro yeah. yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I wanted to go for an uh, American sounding name. Okay. Brody is obviously a very American sounding name. Yeah. And the uh, a series called Homeland, which yes. was one of my favourites, uh, used to watch. The main character was called Broder. Yes. So we all sort of he, he turned there, to like. the other dark side, he did, didn't he? Did, and then back again. <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, uh, yeah, I enjoyed that. Um, so obviously, this is obviously it's, it's American themed, but it's uh, healthy eating. It so is, you're yeah. promoting healthy eating. So yeah. what sort of stuff do you serve here? Okay, so it's a bit of a mixture, really, of um, build your own, which is basically you choose protein, carbohydrate, uh, veg, and a sauce. So we, for those people who are calorie counting or they yeah. want something where they can, they, they know they're eating healthy food. Um, they can build their own box, but we also do the American themed stuff. So like your burgers, your Philly cheese steaks, um, we're, we're bringing out wraps as well. So we've got like steak and halloumi wraps, um, which will be on the menu from tomorrow uh, and kids meals. So all that American themed stuff, but you've taken out all the rubbish and saturated fats, the sugars and all, all that sort of stuff. Um, and we're, we're putting good stuff back into it. So all yeah. the burgers are made with 5% mints. Um, brioche and, and they're all well. made it's, and they're all made fresh they are nothing, yeah, nothing made fresh in store so there's nothing um there's nothing frozen we use all fresh ingredients which we we either get in daily or, or uh, by daily um and it's all made fresh in store on the day so obviously if you're watching this uh, on social media now it really helped obviously a, a new local businessman uh, in the area so if you could just click share for me now that would be absolutely great uh, or feel free to tag any of your friends who might be interested in this because it's obviously quite important that we get this new business up and running and get it out there to the whole community so if you could actually help with that that would be great i'd be much appreciated um so um obviously healthy eating uh, what sort of hours are you operating? Six days a week. We're open Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday uh, from 8 a.m. till 4 p.m. We're open on Friday from 8 a.m. till 6 p.m. And we're open Saturday 9 till 6, Sunday 9 till 1. Um, so that's serving breakfast from 8 till 11. And then we flick over to the dinner menu, which is from uh, 11 till 4 or 11 till 6, depending on the day. Uh, and then Sunday's breakfast all day. So we do a breakfast brunch on a Sunday. So it's, Great. It's a and I, and I, I have sampled some of the food I've had lunch <laughs> here uh, a couple of times and I can uh, I personally strongly recommend it. Uh, obviously, people can do a weekly meal plan with yes. you. Uh, yeah. So you, ha you can do that online. Yes, and you can. So um, with the weekly meal plans, um, for we, have, we all got busy lives. So um, we've got quite a few customers who order their meals up front for the week. Um, so it's... Uh, it's, it's called meal prep, everybody knows it is meal prep. So basically you choose five meals for the week or if you want lunch and dinner, you choose your 10. You pick four, three up on the Monday, fresh, mm -hmm. and then two up on the Wednesday, which is for the rest of the week. Uh, some people like to pick up all five because they are too busy. Uh, they'll put two in the, refrig um, in the freezer, sorry. Uh, the other three in the fridge and then they're set for the week basically. So the meals are there, you're not having to worry about scrambling around for ingredients, you don't have to worry about scrambling around for ideas. So, it's all done, set up for you with veg. Yeah, and done and dusted. Sweet and potato and all sorts. That's it, throw it in the microwave and off yeah. you go. Yeah. Perfect, so if anyone's looking to obviously uh, have a healthier lifestyle, uh, that's something that Danny is trying to promote uh, and he will set it all up for you. So uh, how can people get in touch with you to put an order in? Okay. Uh, I presume you're, on, you're obviously on Facebook. Yes. Uh, WhatsApp, do you do anything like that? Yeah, so we use run all social media streams. So um, Facebook, Instagram are obviously the main ones. Yeah. WhatsApp, um, all of our WhatsApp details or the, the message link is on Facebook as well. The best way to contact us is Facebook um, or WhatsApp. Um, again, you can do Instagram Messenger. So any of them, we'll pick it up on a day, we'll reply back as soon as possible. 
all our other forms are on Instagram and Facebook as well if you do want to rather than me. So how, how much notice do you need to say like, it's like 11 o'clock, I'm getting a bit peckish, right. I think I, I don't know what to have for lunch. Yeah, if you want to order anything for lunch there and it's just a one meal or yeah. uh, you want to do anything off the online order, yeah. um, it's 30 minutes. Okay. If you want to order online, you can come and collect in 30 minutes. For the meal preps, we need 24 hours notice because yeah. there's a, a, a quite a lot. And there's an online incident. ordering form for there things is, like yeah. that. On, yeah, uh, so as long as you give 24 hours notice, for the meal preps, we, we can um, get them set up for you for the, for the rest of the week. So, so how long have you done this? Is this something that you set up when COVID was happening? Or? Yeah, it was, well, since 2018, it was sort of an idea. That's when uh, I come up with the idea and sort of drew up a few plans of how I wanted the business to go, really. It's changed drastically, not just over the, that period, but within the last three months. Yeah, it's so, it evolves, it's done yeah, it, yeah. it does. Um, so yeah, it was it was just something that I did for myself originally. Then friends and family were asking, like, the look at the meals we do me. So then friends of friends, and it just sort of snowballed from there. Then so um, yeah, I, I started it from home, then moved home, continued in my own kitchen, um, doing food for friends and family, and then it, it evolved into a business. Was doing it for people I didn't know. Um, and then I just want to say thank you to Ask Aesthetics because when they closed this place down and moved, um, Sam Ward, who, who runs uh, Ask Aesthetics, she uh, offered me this place and said it'd be ideal for you. Mm. She gave it me rent free for a period of time. She paid the rent. So I just want to say a massive thank you to, okay. to Sam Ward and, and her team. Um, obviously, you're involved with grassroots football, things like that. Yes. So uh, yeah. how are you encouraging that with healthy eating? How are you... Okay. trying to link it all together yeah, so for, for the kids obviously. that's become sort of part of the business plan really is uh is, is being involved within the community not just sort of offering food for people for collection takeaways he's offering an insight and education really to, to the local community um and starting at that very young age so okay, we want to go out into the schools we want to educate children on food um how to prepare food themselves how to eat stuff they like pizzas burgers and stuff like that what healthier versions so Yeah, because we were just talking beforehand and saying that, you know, it's very easy just to nip to McDonald's to get a burger, yeah. but, you know, you can do a healthier version of that. It's yeah, made yeah. with better quality yeah. ingredients and a yeah, bit more so. love and care. And yeah. we do want to, to, we want to educate the community, um, not just around the food and, and but it's around sort of healthy living, really. Okay. So um, eating well and exercising. So we want to support grassroots teams and grass uh, sort of grassroots um, communities. We want to go out to local clubs um, and support them in, in sort of their education. Uh, and again, just the, there is a couple of things sort of in the pipeline in regards to offering um, free meals to children with a paying adult on a Saturday who, who come in in grassroots uniforms. So anybody who's football kit, rugby kit, it could be theatre, dance. We, we're not just sort of saying sport only. As long as a child's involved in some form of exercise, um, we are going to, be, going to be running a promotion soon on a Saturday where children will eat free. Where with a paying adult. Any plans to do takeouts? Or there is, yeah. Or? yeah. Um, we've just um, been signed off with uh, Uber Eats and Just Eat. So Great. we are hopefully in the coming week, maybe shorter period of time, we'll, we'll be on them platforms so people can order um, from Just Eat and, uh, and Uber Eats as well. Okay. So Well, that, that's a good, good thing to look forward to. But obviously, in the meantime, feel free yeah. to get in touch via Facebook. Uh, and WhatsApp yep. and Instagram yep, and things like that. Uh, all right. Well, thank you very much. Is there anything else you would like to say before we uh, sign it off? Um, not really. No, just to thank people for the support of the last okay. few months. It's, it's a new business. It's a journey yeah. for us and our team. Uh, we're constantly looking to, to evolve and, and improve and learn as we go along. Yeah. Um, and yeah, we just want to keep getting better and, and serving the community in the right way, really. Yeah, a healthy living. What, what could be better? Um, so again, if you are, are passing or hungry for breakfast or lunch, then feel free to nip in, give them a call, Facebook them, however you want to get in touch with them. That would be absolutely great. Uh, mention, obviously, you've seen the video, so Danny knows what's actually working marketing-wise. Um, and uh, that's it. Well, thank you very much for no, taking your you. time today. Uh, and if anyone's still watching, uh, please, again, just share this for us. That would be absolutely great. Uh, thanks for watching uh, and don't forget to love M44.